Meanwhile, the Target 12 investigators have been tracking down details behind the emergency response to last night's fire. We have the timeline of what happened through the voices of the police department. We have, uh, we have four patients on the third floor and six workers. Command Chief, Command to Ladder also check out the status of those occupants. See if they need to be removed from that floor. That was about eight minutes after firefighters arrived on scene. We heard firsthand how important communication was in this case. Target 12 investigator Walt Buteau with the details. Ten people, including four patients, were on the floor beneath the burning roof. No injuries, though, and the fire was doused before evacuations were needed. Third floor, showing flames. The first call to the fire department came in around 12 minutes after 8, and only 90 seconds later. We got fire showing on the third floor. Come in, Heisberg, Heisberg. The first crew on scene knew right away they needed help. As they sprayed water from the street, another crew went at it from a different angle. Fire alarm, I have ladder ring going from the interior stairs up to the roof. I don't want to tap you to access the roof from the exterior. Seven minutes in, the fire not yet under control. There was information on a possible cause. I got a report that was uh, working on the roof a few hours ago. Uh, they obviously ignited it. About 30 seconds after that, Positive news from the flat top roof. I'm up on the roof. It looks worse than it is. Once we get water, we'll be able to uh, hit it quick. But still concern after new details come in about who was in the building under the roof and the fire. We have four patients on the third floor and six workers. Around the time the fire was said to be under control, firefighters on the roof offered a warning to everyone else on scene. Stay away from the, where the roof was on fire. It is spongy at 2023. The fire was reported under control at around 824, 12 minutes after firefighters arrived. We were told while no one was evacuated, several patients had to be moved from their rooms due to water damage. With the Target 12 investigators, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.